break the new iOS version 5.0 which just came out today. Now you're going to need two downloads and a few things to note before we start. This jailbreak is tethered for one and two this will not work on the iPad 2 or the iPhone 4s but if there is an update to this video click on the annotation or link in the description now as the next jailbreak will be a lot better than this one and you will not want to deal with this if there is a new update so make sure to check for an annotation if that exists. For this jailbreak you're going to need two downloads, you're going to need Red Snow and you're going to need the 5.0 firmware for your device. You can get these both with the link in the description. We have a guide linked to you. Just go to the download section and download both of the things you need. First you're going to open Red Snow. Uh, simply unzip it and open it. This works for the uh, PC as well. You can get the Windows version and you're just going to need to open Red Snow. Both Mac and PC everything is pretty much the same. So the first step you're going to need to do is hit the extras button and then you're going to hit select IPSW. Now what you're going to do is find the IPSW 5.0 for your device which you downloaded previously. Now you can hit open and hit OK. Now continue with hitting back and hitting jailbreak to start the process. So we'll patch a few things and this should be done shortly. On this next step you can check anything, just make sure install city is checked. So we're going to hit enable multitasking gestures as well, you can do that if you want, and hit next. Now once we do this it's going to tell us to get into DFU mode, so, so I will be showing you how to do that right now. So we're going to hit next and then hit the top button for three seconds, hold both the buttons for this next time, and when that is ready, release the top button while holding the home button, and wait for it to continue to the next step, and there we go, exploiting with Limerain, you should see your device will be Um, ready to reboot. Once it reboots, it will start jailbreaking. And that could take a few seconds. There we go. We have the device now jailbreaking. And this process can take a few minutes. However, you are not done. Even if it looks like it, you're going to need a boot tether to be able to use Cydia. So it says done here, but you're not actually done. So we can see this is going on right now. So you can hit uh, cancel because everything's on the device now and you're going to have to open up Red Snow again. Now we're going to be waiting for the device to uh, finish jailbreaking and wait a little while for that and it should work. So on the second part, you're going to need to open up Red Snow like we said before and hit extras. Now you're going to have to select your IPSW again like you did before. Should be pretty simple, hit OK. And you're going to have to hit just boot to just boot tether now. When you do that, you're going to have to do the same thing to go into DFU mode, and we'll be showing you how to do that again. So just hold the top button for three seconds, hold the home button as well, and wait for the timer to go down, and the device will turn black. Release your top hand, and wait for the next menu to appear. And there we have it. Now the device uh, should be... Uh, booting up right now, it's exploiting, and should turn on shortly. Waiting for the reboot again, and there you go, you should have an app or a pineapple on your device, and soon after it should boot, and it says done on Red Snow, so you're actually done with the computer, and you just gotta wait for your device to boot up. Now I'll be quickly demoing that Cydia does work. Okay guys, so um, now that the device turned on, you can see Cydia right there. We can open it, and it does actually open. You'll know that if the icon is filled in with a little box, opposed to being white. If it's white, make sure you follow the steps to boot tethered, and you'll see that Cydia is fully functional. So there you go, you've jailbroken iOS 5. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.